Okay, so this is how I sow my sweet corn. I start them off like this in a um, takeaway pot with wet kitchen towel for a few days and you can see you have a nice root forming and the stem. I think the term is radical for the root and hypercotyl for the, the stem. Something like that anyway. So once you've got that you can just pop it in your compost and these are root trainers. I find these work really well with sweet corn just because the roots form really nice strong roots which go down and then you just get a big dibber, dip a big hole, open up the root trainers and pop them in. It makes a really strong plant then. And you can see I'm just teasing that down because I've got a root and a hypercotyl stem I know exactly which way it goes there we go and again there I've got a nice radical and hypercotyl there's a focus on this there we go so again I just pop that in tease it in and they'll be, they'll be poking up in a day and these are the ones I started last week and not all not all corn will do this um, you can try it after two days if nothing's formed then get them out there quickly because they'll just rot and then just pop them straight into some compost some some corn do this some some corn don't for some reason um, but this is one I do every year, it's called Early Bird. It's very reliable, it's a great tasting sweet corn. And there we go, these root trainers, um, it's worth looking after them. I've had them about four years now, and they're quite expensive, so yeah, definitely treat them well. Um, you can just reuse them and reuse them. So that's these done and labelled up nicely, Early Bird and swift and uh, now the reason i do this um is a few reasons one i want 100 percent germination and um, so i want all these root trainer um compartments filled up i don't want to waste any um you want to be able to ch um, choose your your strongest seed so the, the ones that germinate quickest um you don't want any of the ones that are, are rotting or or just not very good so you can dispose of those if you've got any excess, I'll put the, um, the spare ones in this little little tray here. Um, I'm not too sure what I'll do with them when they when they pop up. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to put these in the greenhouse now. So there we go, they're in the greenhouse. Now, these are the ones that didn't do anything after two days. These are a variety called Luscious. They're a bicoloured sweet corn. Um, F1, I believe, again. Um, so I just put them straight into this compost and uh, hopefully they should they should pop up but yeah don't you don't want to leave them in a in a, in a tray with kitchen towel um, soaking for more than two days they'll they'll just rot um, so get it get them out there okay